For generations, steel helped define the economy and the culture of the Ohio River Valley. But today, the steel industry faces serious challenges. Traditional steel jobs in Allegheny County, the heart of steel country, have declined by nearly 30% in just the last 10 years, moving out of state or overseas, or being automated away altogether. And traditional steelmaking methods are also energy intensive and dirty, accounting for nearly 8% of global carbon dioxide emissions. Scientists say the iron and steel industry must cut emissions in half by 2050 to meet global climate goals. Fortunately, a more sustainable way to make steel is already within reach. The leading pathway for green steelmaking uses a three-step process that produces nearly zero greenhouse gas emissions. Renewables are used to create hydrogen, which is then used instead of coal to make steel. Green steel is also a job creator. New research shows that transitioning to green steel making could grow steel-related jobs in western Pennsylvania by up to 43% by 2031. And that's not all. Investing in the renewable energy infrastructure needed for green steel making will attract other manufacturers looking to decarbonize their processes. Smart investments could help Pennsylvania lay the foundation for the nation's first clean manufacturing hub. If we do nothing, we risk that current trends will continue. Fewer and fewer steel jobs, decade after decade, while continuing to pollute our air and disproportionately harming the health of low-income communities and communities of color. Investing in green steelmaking is a win for families, the climate, and the economy. And billions in federal funding can provide the kickstart we need to drive the steel industry into a cleaner 21st century economy. Learn more about the benefits of the green steel transition at OhioRiverValleyInstitute.org.